My name is Darren. Today we'll be talking about how to take small steps towards our great goals. As we end the month of May and move into June, Singaporeans are beginning to march towards what is called our new norm. And yet at the same time, many Singaporeans are also perhaps feeling unsure, a little bit uncertain about what this new environment will look like. Goals are important, and yet if we set too high a goal, especially during these times of uncertainty, it may actually demotivate us. Therefore, it is important to set small steps to achieve our great goals. Don't get me wrong now. All of us should still be very, very persistent with our goals. Because great goals sometimes can demotivate us, it is important, especially during these times of uncertainty, to focus on our small wins. Our small wins will continue to motivate us as we march towards our great goals. There are two criteria that establishes our small wins. The first being things that require little effort. Second, things that require little time. When we focus on small wins that focuses on little effort and little time, we will find that it is easy to achieve these wins and it also motivates us to pursue our greater goals. In 2017, I decided to compete in a Spartan race. In the very same year, I broke my hip as well. Did that, however, break my dream? Did that stop my dream of completing a Spartan race? No. Rather, what I did was that I decided to break out my dream into smaller steps. And it was through using this strategy that ultimately in 2018, I was able to complete a full-on 5km Spartan race. What was my trick? It was neuroplasticity. You see, as long as we can keep telling our brain that we can do it, it can be achieved, success is in our hands, our brain will believe it. the importance of using small wins, using small steps to achieve our great goals. If we start with the great goals, sometimes we actually don't believe it ourselves whereby we then tell ourselves that all these goals, no matter how high they seem to be, is achievable, that we start to believe in ourselves. It is through self-belief that we can ultimately reach our dream. Friends, the time that we have for each other has come to an end here on Time Out with Dr. Darren. However, if you would like to continue and keep in contact, please contact me in my Facebook channel. Meanwhile, take care God bless and remember, disability is only in the mind.